Hello and welcome to your Caspio account. Let's take a quick, fast-paced look at how to begin. We'll start by creating a new application. I'm going to set up my application from scratch, but you can just as easily begin by importing your existing data and tables from an Access database, Excel spreadsheets, XML, or text. You can also import data by going to tools at a later time. In this example, I'm going to create a simple application that allows inspectors to submit restaurant inspections to the database. Let's call it Restaurant Inspections and click Finish. From here, you can explore our sample contact management application that's already inside your account, or you can click on Open to begin building your own application. You will now be able to see a list of objects on the left-hand side. You'll want to start with the tables object first. To build a table, Click on New and list all the fields you'd like to store inside it. In my example, I'm building a restaurant inspection form, so naturally I'll want to list all the fields pertaining to restaurant inspections. To speed up on time, I have already pre-configured my table with all the necessary fields along with their appropriate data types. For example, you can see that I wish to collect the date and time of a particular inspection, so I turned that field into a date and time data type. Let's go ahead and save our table now and call it Inspections. As for the naming convention, it's best to name the table according to the data that you'll be storing inside it. Now let's go ahead and build our inspection form by going to the Data Pages object. Click on New to launch Caspio's point-and-click data page wizard. By default, the submission form will always be selected at first, but you have the ability here to select and create from various types of application interfaces needed for your own project. On the next screen, you'll want to select your inspections table using the data source dropdown. This is how you link your tables to your desired data pages. You can also select a different style and localization to change the aesthetics and regional settings. On this screen, you can also apply a specific user level authentication if you wish to pass or protect your data pages. On the next screen, we'll include our fields to the form, and finally, we'll modify each one of our fields using the configuration screen. To speed up on time, I have already configured each one of my fields using the form element dropdown and applying a specific type of element to each field. I can now preview the form to see what it looks like, and if I'm happy with the design, I can click on Finish to finalize the changes. We now have the form completed. To publish and share this form with the inspectors, we will simply click on Deploy, Enable access to the form, and based on your preference, you could either embed the form to a web page by copying and pasting a snippet of code, share the form using a direct URL link, or choose from three other methods that Caspio provides. When the inspectors submit the form, the data will automatically populate inside your database table. With the data inside the table, I could now quickly, with just a few minutes, construct a report that allows an admin user to quickly pull up historical data of all of the inspections. Once you're done configuring all the screens of the data page wizard, you'll once again click Finish to save your changes. By publishing the report, you'll now have the ability to filter results based on specific criteria and be able to modify records by performing a mass update, grid edit, or drilling down to details to edit any of the inspection data. So, what type of applications are you trying to build? Do you need forms to input data? Do you need reports to output the data? Do you need to plot data on charts and calendars, or even pass or protect applications with multi-user level authentications? Are you a developer and want to take advantage by extending your Caspio applications with industry standard languages such as JavaScript, HTML, SQL, or even connect to our database using REST or SOAP-based APIs? No matter the case, Caspio has the tools for non-technical and technical users alike to build powerful applications with minimal effort. We hope you enjoyed this overview, and as always, if you have any questions or need any assistance, we are just a phone call away. For additional videos and helpful articles, visit our knowledge base at howto.caspio.com.